Hi there, YouTubers. This is Chris with Chris's Trains and More. Hope you're having a great day. Just a little update. Uh, the wife is now happy. I did end up buying her some flowers from the last train. It turned around and uh, was delivered in the flower box. So needless to say, Mama's happy. Mama's happy, that's a good thing. So anyways, today I ended up getting another delivery and of course I'm always shopping around. You can hear the Santa Fe here talking. <laughs> uh, anyways, I got another delivery today and I was kind of excited to get it. So I figured I'd turn around and do uh, another opening. Uh, one thing though, like I always say, whenever you're buying and, or selling anything, it's very appreciative if you do a good job boxing and wrapping things. I don't know if you can uh, hear it, but sounds like the train's pretty loose in here. So hopefully when we open this up, we don't have any problems. So I'm going to go ahead and do it in front of everybody and we'll see what happens. This should be a Lionel post-war uh, New York Central B unit, 2354, uh, 2354T. I believe it is. So we'll find out together what kind of shape it's in. Hopefully there's uh, no problems. Like I said, unfortunately you can kind of hear it clinking around in there. Try to be careful. I don't know how much the post office would have bounced it around. Hopefully this isn't a real sad video. Find out here in a second. They did put some paper on either side of it. Wow, now there's a surprise. It was not listed that the original box was included. So that's pretty cool that the original box was here. And we'll slide it out of here. Let's see what we got. We'll keep our fingers crossed. A little box flap falling off, but I think we can handle that. We're looking at everything. Couplers still look good. This one's kind of stuck. Probably from it bouncing around inside the box. Uh, looks like it's in pretty good shape, all in all. Bring it over a little bit closer for you to see it. Um... Actually, I mean, like I said, not too happy about the way it was packed, that it was kind of rattling around in there. But I was really pleased to find that the original box was in there. So, yeah, I'm going to say that this is a success. It's usually kind of hard to find just the B unit. I had called a couple of my uh, favorite train stores, and a lot of the stores had, you know all three pieces but of course they wouldn't want to sell the B unit you know and separate it so I think this will be a nice addition to my uh, my full set here now so yep looks pretty good so we'll have to turn around and uh, I'll do a video uh, get everything lined up and get everything running and uh, see how everything looks when it's all together so like I said, this one was a success. It's kind of scary at first, but looks good. All right, I appreciate you watching the video. If you like the video, please uh, give it a thumbs up. Uh, if you have any comments or anything or anything you might want to see me run, let me know. Thanks for watching.